So, this video is going to be lame as hell. Now, if you think that you have the attention span, if you have the will, I think that you don't. All you have to do is sit with me through every single episode of this game. And you see, you won't even know what the thing is unless you moved on to the next part. You have to sit through every single clip of this. I have a challenge. I am playing... First off, how's it going, everybody? My name is Cloud, and welcome to Presentable Liberty. Now, you see, Presentable Liberty is a game that consists entirely of day one of standing in a blank room. You, I am inside of a jail cell. This recording looks squashed as hell. It makes you look even more claustrophobic. All you have is the ticking of the clock. And that's all you have to do. I want to see what performs better. This video, all as one cohesive video, just completely unedited, or the same video, but the only difference is that every 15 seconds there's a cut. And you have to go on to the next one. I'll be uploading this video onto YouTube Shorts, onto, onto Instagram Reels, not to TikTok. And I just want to see. You won't even be able to read this properly. You see, if you want to be able to understand everything that's being written, you have to watch the full length video. But you see, attention span who? By the way, I had to write, write that backwards for this. But let us get into the video of Presentable Liberty. My dear friend, I hope this letter finds you well. How is prison life going for you? I know it must be hard, especially in times like these. As for me, I will soon start another of my journeys into the unknown. Wish me luck, Salvador the Traveler. And you see, the letters are just like TikToks. Each one. Oh, look at the little guy on the floor. This little guy. Friend, I hope you aren't feeling too lonely in that dark cell. Just in case, I have put a little bug friend for you in the envelope alongside this letter. Salvador. I know this feels just like a... a it feels like a fucking... Uh... You see, then that would have been another cut. You see, it's already been three minutes into this. You see, most people would have clicked off. Most people would have scrolled on by now. Who knows? Another brain rot cat video. Another crazily edited Fortnite video. Who knows? Another fan edit of another thing. Who knows? The thing is, though, is I really want to see if you or anyone could actually make it through this. I bet you can't. I bet you can't. Good day. We are happy to inform you that you have been selected by me, Dr. Money, to join an exclusive program for inmates all over the country. And that would have been another cut. I do like the little guy. You can't even see him underneath the bench, but it's cool. We have noticed that due to the recent outbreak of a terrible virus, the population of our beautiful nation has started dwindling. This is unfortunate, but there is still hope. You. you know, I you know at first I thought this 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 game wouldn't have been good for this, but I think that the letters actually make it to where because it's broken up individually, that it would actually make for a better video because you have to get each bit by bit. Now I do think that um I do want to oh I'm sorry is my. Is my camera just a tad too big for the screen? As you can see, my desktop has to be... Like, if you're watching this on YouTube, it looks totally fine. Messy as it may be. But on the TikTok version, you just see a bunch of stuff crammed into it. So it's super funny. Recent studies show that 98% of... Oh. Mm, hold on. Oh, that bad.
Maybe that'll work. Hold on, let's see. Recent studies show that 98% of our great nation's population is already infected with the virus. Incidentally, many of the remaining 2% are prisoner inmates like you. We hope that you continue to be vigilant and remain healthy. I'm having fun with this. This is stupid. This is so stupid. In order to fight depression and suicidal thoughts in the dire situation you have found yourself in, you will be assigned your own personal happy buddy, TM. Enjoy. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's so fun. Hello, hello, hello! I'm your own personal happy buddy, TM. I have a present for you! Five confetti poppers. Have fun! Press the right mouse button to use items. Wazd move, interact. Okay, cool. Select item, toggle full screen, you're skipping the menu. Okay. Interesting, interesting. Hello, my buddy friend buddy. Did you enjoy the confetti? If so, I have another present for you. Oh, I guess I can use one. Me. <laughs> This is so fucking dumb. I love it. Oh, God. It's a Dr. Money Portable Entertainment Machine. Game included. Have lots of fun. Use mouse window to switch between items. Okay, use right mouse button. All right. Serpent. Oh, wow. This is like warpy snake. Oh. Uh, this game is actually pretty hard. Hold on. I know that there's... Y yeah, you're here for some sick Osu gameplay, but it turns out you actually just got... You actually just got me being really shit at Snake. All right, press right my button and put away. Okay. My dear friend, they start in, I have started my journey in the Far East with no clear goal in mind. On the road, I met a nice woman who gave me directions to the nearest lake. You know how much I love swimming. Friend, this lake is beautiful. It's so peaceful and quiet here. Have you ever been so alone that you cannot convince yourself of the fact that other people exist anymore? Salvador. See, I love it. Because we are stuck inside of this. <laughs> You're stuck here with me now. If you've made it this far to part, what is it, 8 or 9, 10, 15, 25? Who knows? But if even then, if you've made it this far, hit, hit, just like all of the sequential videos. Or if you're watching this long form, hit a like on the video. Comment the fact that I've made it this far. This is a social experiment. And we'll be able to figure out the drop-off points. But if you see, if you want to watch it, you need to know. Friend, I have a present for you. It's a present that always reminds me of the spirit of travel. I hope it, it will liven up your sail a little bit. Sal. Oh, look at this MS paint fucking your baby. Fucking shit. Hey, buddy. How are you doing? If you're feeling down, maybe a song will help. La! Happy la 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 be alive ha ha glad be alive ha 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 that was fun wasn't it I hope you keep a song in your heart always for you are smart and kind and important I want to see edits of this I want people to be like what in the fuck is Doc on is this just the brink of insanity yes indubitably that is exactly what's happening yeah Good day, Mr. Smiley. We have noticed that you have not met your happiness quota yet. Remember, you will only get to see your daughters again if you manage to lower the suicide rates in prison. Dear Blank, we have accidentally sent you a letter of advice to a certain Mr. Smiley. We want you to know that this mistake has been rectified and your happy buddy really does like you and is your best friend purely because you are so friendly. Oh no, it is dark. It's dark, you can't even see the screen. Ha <laughs> How are you doing? I'm feeling so great. You are my greatest friend, the happiest friend in the whole wide world. Friend, if my calculations are correct, then this letter will arrive at your cell right around bedtime. I hope those prison beds are comfortable. Good night, friend. Salvador. Press space to go to bed. 
day two. If we made it to day two, then holy fucking shit. Ooh, look, another letter at our doorstep. Rise and shine, sleepyhead. I hope you had a good night's sleep. I sure did. Hooray! To celebrate the occasion of you getting up, I have sent you a second game for your portable entertainment product. Oh. What game have we now? Fear of Fire? Oh, shit. These games... I, I hope that the game... You know, I love this game. It's so great. Okay, this game's actually pretty, pretty cool. I'm a lot better at this one than I was at Serpent. Probably because I'm bad at Snake in general. We gotta be careful. I love the 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 burning in the background. All right, hold on. Let me finish this level. Friend, I have decided to head north, which is, as you know, my favorite cardinal direction to head. By the way, I passed by a very interesting river. A sign next to it said that the water changes the direction it is flowing in around this time of year. Fascinating, wouldn't you say, friend? I must say, and I must stay here and witness the change occurring. My curiosity is just too tremendous to resist the temptation. As much as I enjoy fast landscapes and new locations to explore, sometimes life must appreciate the little things. Sal. You see, you see, it's a commentary on the game itself. On this video, the fact that even now people aren't even watching due to this part in the long form, but since it's a short form content, probably is going to be the exact s people are going to actually be getting a lot more views on this cumulatively. You see, this is only just the part one of my plan. I'm going to do this with a whole bunch of other videos just to see how it goes. But I feel like this is a good kicking off point to see if this is even feasible. <laughs> I have another present for you. It's a poster to remind you to always keep a smile on your face. Oh, goody, goody gumdrops. Look at that smile. Yes. Good day. I don't think you know me, but from what I've heard, it seems that you and I are the last people in this town who are still not infected with the virus. I am the owner of a pastry shop not far from where your cell is, but as, as I don't want to get infected, I cannot sell my pastries to anyone anymore, except you. I would really appreciate it if, it if you would visit me sometime and maybe have a cup of tea. I love this little dude. I guess we just keep playing it's Fear of Fire. Oh uh, yeah, we're on level 420, let's go baby. Wait, so I could beat these? And I love the sound design. You see, everything about this just makes this unnerving. The letter from Charlotte. By the way, my name is Charlotte. Nice to meet you. You know, every time I look over and I just see that another 15 seconds have passed, I just think that another video has already been uploaded. Oh, I do fear that I will have to keep on doing this. You see, I'm going to sit here, and the game will probably end in a matter of hours. But the thing is, though, is that you'll have no idea. You see, the long form of this video will just keep on going. That's us it through the entire game. But you see, by splitting it up into 15 second chunks, I really do bet that I could somehow trick the audience into watching the entirety of the game. Oh, look, blue flames as well. Oh, my days. It is getting more difficult. Who knows? You know, this game's kind of like asteroids, except you can't really shoot anything. They cross in the middle more, though. Ooh. All right. Let's keep on going. 
my dearest companion, my friend, my river, bleh, the river's change in direction was quite interesting to see. This is exactly what I love about my travels. You always get to see new and amazing things. Salvador. I know this is just the same as Markiplier's video, but you see, it's going to be a bit different because it's built for the TikTok generation. You can't handle yourselves. You need another clip of this. And guess what? I will be spreading. You see, these will upload around at the same time. But can you handle it? Can you handle the sitting still long enough to watch all of this? I really don't think you can. But I do like the way that this is framed. Who knows? Maybe some more exciting gameplay will be to ensue. But I really... I really want to see these videos do good. I really want to see that, like, either way, I'm getting views. Like, on YouTube, I'm still going to, I like, it goes, it boosts my number. The algorithm will love me, regardless. The sheer fact of so many of these will happen. And you see, all I have to do is that for the TikTok versions, all I have to do is simply censor all the swear words. And you see, because the fact that most of it's me reading notes, I won't even have to do that. So who knows? Maybe you'll actually just see the entire thing to completion. They'll put it as for kids and then they'll end up watching the whole thing. Who knows? Who knows? Oh, it's getting harder. Oh, uh, but I'm almost at 20. Hold on. We're, we're, we, we win these. It's just the ticking of the clock. No, hold on. Oh. Alright, fine. We'll read the next letter. Because you just have to see what happens. I'm very sorry I came off to as too eager in my last letters to you. Fact is, I haven't really had much contact with people anymore lately. Please forgive me as if I made you feel uncomfortable. Charlotte. Aww. She's just a fem cell. Good to see some fem cell representation in our games. Man, this would be really fun to edit. Nah, let's keep playing. Oh, boy. Oh, Jimmy Christmas. Oh, the, there's little ones. Am I a speeder? Ooh, level 15. Five more, and then we can make it to the end of this game. I don't know. Does it have a hard mode? Oop. Ow. Bollocks. This will also be a testament to how long I can go without swearing. I really don't know if I'll be able to make it. Not at this rate, anyway. How long can you sit still in your chair? How long can you live inside your cell? How long can you manage? Your mind must be going crazy by now. Because you just want to see the furthering of the story, but you have to see me fail through this game in order to get to it. Oh, they're different each time. That's suspicious. Oh, another attempt down. Oh, I guess the game has had different plans for me. Oh, it's my happy buddy. Hello, hello, hello. I hope you're enjoying the two games. They were expensive, you know. <laughs> yes, I'm having a very fun time. Yes, as I lose my sanity playing through this game. Stuck on level 16 as the difficulty rises. Oh, no. Ten seconds. Ten seconds feels like a lifetime when every single thing you do just happens to make it reset. Oh, no. We were down to the two-second mark. Oh, no. It's impossible. You, you can't manage to even make it through one level. 
Oh no, so many people will be turned off by this. But wait, how are you supposed to get the next letter? How are you supposed to understand the rest of the story throughout the rest of the game? Oh, you're gonna go look up a walkthrough? Then what kind of a waste would that be? You're already here. You're already here in your short form content. You're already here experiencing 15,000 videos an hour. How are you supposed to make it through? Oh no, I won't be ending this now. I'm very close. 17. Three more to the end of the game. What happens when I beat it? You just have to see all of the attempts. I have you here. You cannot leave. Why? You won't be able to see what happens. What happens when I leave the cell? What happens at the end of the game? Do you want to know the secrets? Do you want to know? Well then, you see, you either have to watch it all in one and skip to the end. Oh no, that would be sacrilegious. <laughs> Please don't be sad. Please. Don't worry about it. You see, because you'll watch all those videos. You see so many things that will have more of your attention. But you see, I have you here. Because I don't think you can make it. I don't think that you can make it throughout the entirety of this video. Without losing your sanity or without giving up. You can't. Is your brain so rotten that you can't even make it through one YouTube video without having to skip over to the next one, going through 15 different videos before you figure out what's happening? Who knows? I know it must be hard, all alone, in a prison cell, but you must remain happy. Please? You see, I am already in sh madness is already ensuing. I can't even sit on my bed that feels like a brick. But you're here. All of the no one. You see, a single 15 second clip of a video of mine that I know that ever that the entire thing will get See, I've already released four different episodes of a show, but you see, the thing is, is that they only got 8 to 10 to 20 views, but a 15 second clip of an edited thing got over 800, closer to 900, and yet, so I want to see what will happen, what happens. It has come to our attention, your happy buddy has shown signs of not behaving in an excited and happy manner. If you wish to have your happy buddy replaced, please send us a letter and we will get rid of him. No. He's doing fine. He'll lose his daughters even though they're already dead, probably. Don't get rid of him, please. Hello, <laughs> hello, I heard that some people are reporting their happy bodies to Dr. Money. <laughs> Please. You have to stay, otherwise what is he going to do? You already know the stakes, we have to be happy, we have to be enjoying this. We have a bug and confetti, what are we supposed to do? Another confetti because you've made it to the 23 minute mark. Oh, almost half an hour has already passed. Will you be able to make it? You know what happens to them, right? Do you? You wouldn't do that to me, would you? <laughs> what? Watch me fade into obscurity on all the fact that you can't stay here. We'll move on to the next one. Cutting off my speech in the most awkward of places, trying to piece it together, because I know that spite is so long the strongest human emotion. You can't help yourself. You're so eager to prove me wrong, so eager to try to fix it. And in the link to every single one of these short videos will be a one to the longer version. If you're so certain that you can make it through this, then just make it to the long form. I'm sorry I haven't gotten you another game yet. I just don't have the money for it at the moment. No, I like the game. It's a good game. I've almost got it finished. Oh. Meow. It's so funny because this is all out of spite. Like, I'm not even enjoying the game. You know, it's it's a juxtaposition. This game is so much more after COVID and TikTok and everything, right? Ooh, one more level to the end. 
I'm so sorry. Will you be able to make it? I know you must be itching just to put the game down, figure out what's happening, but I won't let it happen. Not till I get to the end. That would defeat the point. In the last level. So very sorry. You see, you see, I can't do both. You don't get your subway surfers. You don't get your everything else. And if I see edits of this video that has those kinds of things on it, then you'll have lost the game. You'll, you'll be sacrileging the very part of this that makes this game what it is. The fact that you can't sit still. Your attention span so short and rotten by the sheer amount of videos. This isn't like those therapeutic ones that are like, yes, you must be able to sit through this. You see, I'm breaking down your barriers. This video is longer than 30 seconds long, and you just want to see me in agony at the fact that you can't do it. You'll put yourself through hell just to be like, fuck you. I have already figured it out. I've already gone through the entirety of the video. But what? Will you be able to do it? I believe in the faith of humanity, but I also know that faith isn't what drives us forward. Faith can be whittled away by facts. The analytics will speak for themselves. You'll see what I see. The fact that you can't sit still. Congratulations for completing this game! A valuable badge has been placed in your vicinity. Oh, look! We completed the game. If you've made it to the 2630 mark, which is just about now, then you'll have made it to the to this part of the video. Insane, isn't it? Friend, is your bug friend keeping you company? Have you given him a name? You should. Do you remember how we used to sit by this fireside, carving chess pieces out of wood without a care in the world? That was a long time ago. And uh, I think we shall name the bug. We shall name him. I shall call you Skibbity. My wood carving skills have gotten significantly worse, but I still try to make you something that make you feel less lonely. It's the leg of a table I'm making for you. I know that might not be the most extravagant project, but I hope you like it anyway, Salvador. It's a nice evening, isn't it? I hope you have a nice sleep, Charlotte. Press space to go to bed. The ending of day two. Day three. You've made it to day three by this point. Oh my goodness. The sun rises as our cramped self makes us inch closer to the edge. Morning, morning, morning! I have some very, very good news for you. And look, there's our table leg. Oh goodness gracious. Is this a new game? I got you a new game that lasts my money. This one's a real blast. Have fun. Oh, a new game. Piteous Moonlight. How do I play? It's Flappy Bird. These games are actually really fun. Okay. Don't worry about me spending all my money. I'm okay. I have to stay alive. And there's no option to end it all. This game is actually pretty hard. Hold on. Oh no, 
Another one down. Oh. Oh well. Just stay happy for me, for the love of all that is holy. Stay happy. They're watching. Are you watching? Are you currently watching still? I don't know. You see, I'm in the recording process. There's no way for me to know if you're still there. Are you watching? You have to. You have to stay watching. You have to know what happens. Okay, I think I'm actually getting decent at this game. Oh, I just keep hitting my head on that because I keep hitting the... So, it's a lot easier... Instead of... Uh, I'll get that now. The world has become such a quiet place. Yes. It has. But it's much easier to control this guy. Oh, come on. It's much easier to control him if you just, when you're going straight up, instead of taking your fingers off all the keys, if you put them on all the keys. So many people are dying. I watched them choke to death from my pastry shop's window. Dr. Money has been started selling some kind of antidote, but I don't trust him. Yes, Dr. Money. You know, I really do think that this is... This game came out, like, way before COVID. So, I think the fact that I'm playing this, like... First off, all of you, uh people who remember you remember you see this is what social isolation felt like except you uh oh god it's even harder we're on level five on that one i will not leave my job as much as the loneliness pains me i need to remain here you see it, this is very indicative, and I do like, because like, when you're playing this on widescreen, you'll have the, uh, the, you know, I do, I mean, you know, as much as the craziness of keeping you guys watching has happened, I do like the fact that if you're watching this on widescreen, it feels very normal, you know, it's like, okay, I can at least like walk around and everything, you know, and there's like, there's games to play, it's whatever, like playing this, it feels pretty normal. But I'm constantly, if you'll see, I'm constantly glancing over at the game on the recording so I can see like what this looks like for people. And it definitely feels very interesting. It feels more cramped. It feels more terrifying. How are you doing? I have been busy carving the second leg of your table. May you eventually put a tabletop on it. I have started to feel a little homesick. Perhaps it's my time to end my journey. Salvador. And this is very... So, since we're... Oh, uh, look, we have the second leg. You know, maybe we could do some dips, get some gains in, you know? I mean, these are the thought processes you'd have. You know, they actually look like 2x4s from here. They're just like little 4x4s on the widescreen. It, this is interesting. I do like the squashed perspective of it. And I'm very excited to start recording more games like this. Because it's not very different on my on my recording. It's not. It's not very different. This is very much the exact same you know, it's like it's the same. It's the same. It, it, it's just a plug and I found, and you know, like we have a better camera. So like this feels very, and this this is very much juxtaposing the type of content that is. Like there's a lower barrier of entry, 
for recording on something like a TikTok versus recording on a like a YouTube video because YouTube videos they need that higher value, that higher production. But the thing is though is that my less impressive work on YouTube do really well as shorts. And so that's what I, that's like part of why I want to do this. A so it can boost my numbers, it's just so my my face is getting shown to more people. So more I'll get more viewership, I'll get more like, you know, cuz I really just want people to watch. That's all I really care about. But there have been incidents of people getting upset about how hard the games for Dr. Money's portable entertainment product are. Please do remember. It's not about those games. It's about happiness. And I feel like, because, you know, you can desensitize yourself to horror and stuff. Like, you can have scary things going on. You know, like, you can get used to, you can get used to this kind of stuff over time. Didn't I just do this level? Oh, that's right. I got I I died at the very end. That's kind of annoying. I I know I know I'm not gonna be able to beat that. If I do, I mean, who knows? By the end of this, I might beat the whole thing. I found this poster in my attic. I thought it might cheer you up. Then again, it's not very cheerful. Maybe you want it anyway, though. Yep. Look at that. Yeah. That's a cool thing. And it looks even drearier in the this aspect ratio. Because it it's not as simple as just taking your widescreen and flipping it. Cause you can do that. You can have because I've seen where it's like it's like, hey, turn your phone sideways and you just watch it like normal. That's cool, but I do like the squash perspective. And I'm really glad that I decided to do this game. Because it works very well like this. Especially, like, the dichotomy of it. And the way that it's different. Dear Blank, Dr. Money is taking time off his busy schedule to personally tell you that everything is fine. Everything is fine. But yeah, I, I do like how this looks. It's very much the same. It's very, it's like... And, and for those of you who want to try this along with me, because I know that other content creators, there, there's just a plugin, and I'll leave a link to it in the description of the long form video, so that way I'm not, you know, clogging up the description of every single shorter TikTok I make of this. So if you guys want, you see, the kind of goal is that you watch both, right? It's more about just getting through it. At this point, it's about, it's not so much about, God, this is so hard. I, I know I keep, like, going off the deep end here, but. Ooh, another letter from Charlotte. All right. It's annoying. Did you get the doctor's message? I'm increasingly concerned by the way he is ignoring the people's obvious suffering. The antidote he was talking about is only being sold at a ludicrous price. He does not mean well. So, for those of you who don't know, this game is a, I mean, like anything, any indie game ever, it's very deep and whatever. It's about, oh, sorry. It's about a plan that to make a disease that is very deadly, that is killing people. There are bodies in the streets. And selling, and if you, if you create a disease that infects and kills everybody you can create an antidote for it that you can sell at whatever price like that is that's what this game's about and then what happens is that this is where this game's where it goes wrong and then it and then you have to like replace your organs and so you have to like buy organs but then it's like it's like a whole thing but it's like about this ludicrous plan that you can that you know it's like it's part of like the theory of like what like how covid happened right like there was a government plant set to like call the masses or whatever and i remember these are actual talks that i've had with people about this back when this happened if this if i made this video years and years ago people wouldn't have batted an eye 
but I think that this video or these series of videos, uh, it'll have like a very interesting, it'll, it'll like speak more of the fact it's like being isolated, being like the fact that this is, disease is happening. Like this will be like, you know, like this will be a very interesting way. And I can't wait to see how this happens. Friend, the third leg of your table is finished. Huzzah! I have also started my long journey back to my hometown. I would say I will probably arrive around tomorrow morning. Looking forward to seeing some familiar faces. Sal. Yay! We almost got a full table. I'm so excited. I'm so excited about this. I also do like that I'm using... I found a use for both my cameras. Because I didn't want to just like put it in storage. Because like I, I like using my things. As you'll see, I have a bunch of different things. What the bug doing? You doing something? But um, this this does this game, and I've never, and I don't see any other presentable liberty playthroughs on TikTok or whatever. Probably because it won't perform well. So the fact that like this exists, it'd be interesting. The doctor has lowered the price of the antidote. However, it seems to cause various vital organs to fail. People are now not only dying from the virus, but also from the doctor's cure. I'm terrified. Charlotte. Like, I do like how this is going to go. Like, the whole idea with this. It's terrible. It's horrifying. But, like, and look, you can't even see out the door. You can see, like, a door, and you can't see much else through these really thick bars. And you just got, like, a cable here. But, so now we just sit. And you watch the clock, each agonizing second worse than the last. So this whole thing, this whole idea started out with me fixing my camera. This this one right here, um, not not this one. When I'm referring to you, I'll be referring to you. But but um, I was like, man, I don't know what to record. And I'm like, man, my siblings want more shorts. And that would be cool, but, um, you know, they'll watch them anyway. But we're at the 42-minute mark. If you've made it this long, I mean, if you've made it to this point, then you're pretty much, like, on the rest of the ride. I'll make these 15 seconds, so that way people won't be bugged or whatever. But, you know, like, 15 seconds, so it'll be long enough for you to get the idea. And tell your friends about this. I like this idea. It's fun. And interesting for me. Most of my kicks have gone bad. I just hope this is all over soon. I'm not sure how long I can live all alone. I wish I could come visit you. And, you know, and it does have this sort of weird tension. Like, especially, like, with talking with Charlotte. Like, you have this whole agonizing tension. Just sitting here waiting for that next letter. And it's like a text message. So I know a lot of people can relate to the fact that it's like, yeah, it's a, it's a lot of very, it's like very, very agonizing. This, this waiting. And it's like we're sitting inside a phone. You know, like we have our pictures, we have our games, and we have our, and we have our messages from our people. And it's like this agonizing loneliness to go along with it. And I really enjoy this. I hope you're getting these letters. I'm guessing you just can't respond. Do letters still get delivered in times like these? I hope so. Are you even still alive? Friend, this one gave me some problems, but your fourth table leg is all done now. The last part will be there shortly. Salvador, or the master woodworker. But yeah, because like, I've tried editing it to where like it ga it keeps people's attention the whole time. And I, eventually I found it's just a lot extra work, especially for a YouTube video, like long form content. You have to basically make it to where each individual clip is like a TikTok. But with this, it's like, it kind of writes itself. And I really want to see if like, if the clips will do like that. But I'm going to have like one being unedited and one being, uh, yeah. You know, how about this? This will be spread across three types of content there's the full uncut recording you can watch on the uh on the kumo reo channel i know selfish plug 
and then uh, one that'll be on the main channel. Like the main channel will have like this like trimmed down, and then this will also be on various shorts and things. Are you okay? Apparently, more and more inmates are killing themselves. Please don't do that for your sake and mine. Like, I don't want to get rid of him. He's my little guy. He's my buddy. He's my Jiminy Jam. And you just hear the things in the background. Like, I don't want to edit this too much. Because there's not a lot of there's not a lot of things I could do to this. Like a game like this, you kind of need it to be raw and uncut. So it being in a short form video will make it better. My dear friend, my goodnight present to you would be the tabletop. Now you finally have something to put stuff on in your cell. I hope you act you actually have stuff to put on it. Sal. Hey, we have a table. I wonder how did you get it in here? Any more letters before goodnight? Maybe. Press space to go to bed. Day four. Oh, we have a new letter in the morning. Friend, my journey has come to an end. As you know, I do not have a family to come home to. But that's not what matters to me. I'm just looking forward to the smell of my hometown. So we're 46 minutes in. As we're on this point. So if you're just keeping up with this at this point. Uh, congratulations. You've made it this far. Uh, that's weird. The game sounds went. Coming in for a second. Oh. You know, I do like the fact that it's like it's not even about me playing the games. Because, I mean, the games are just a track of time and me talking to myself in this camera, isolated in my room, is, is enough entertainment for me. Where is everyone? By this point in the video, no one's watching. If this were a live stream, no one would be here. So it's kind of interesting that that's how it, I do like the back and forth of this that there's not a lot of letters coming through it's just me sitting here I know it's a chance for me to play the games and get good lol but I do like the fact that this game because like I can because right now as I'm recording it's all just speculation. I don't know how this is going to perform. I have an idea just by how my other videos perform and how my shorts perform versus my long form videos perform versus how my live streams perform. But it's just really interesting how this, how I think this will go. Morning! I sold my house and my food and one of my lungs, but don't worry. I spent the money on you for another game. Yay, have fun. Be happy. No. Don't, don't, I don't, no, I don't want games. Oh my god. I found a bug. Look, watch this. Hold on, okay, okay, hold on, I actually want to see. What happens if you don't play the game properly? Okay, so. This is very interesting. If I just keep it out of frame, it can't do anything. Oh. 
<laughs> okay. There's a bug. <laughs> These streets used to be so lively. Now they're just silent. I want something to put on this. Wait, can I, like, just sit on this all weird? Because, you know, I can't sit normal. It's, uh, for those of you who just watch my Let's Plays, just in general, uh, I switched chairs. I don't have the big gamer chair anymore. It started dilapidating, and so now we're back to the, uh, classic green chair. As you guys can probably hear on the microphone, if I, uh, if I set this up correctly. And I know that TikTok audience, I'm not staring at the camera all the time. It's very hard for me to like just crane my neck this way for that. But, um, you know, say la vie, I guess. I have this old gramophone in my basement. Perhaps it's time to break the silence. Will I be able to hear it? Hawk, who goes there? All right, we're going to play some. Hold on, hold on. I'm getting good at this game. Oh, come on. Okay, so I just have to, like, be... I have to actually touch the thing. Okay. Do you know what's going on out there? The virus? The organs? The blood? Mistakes were made. I, Dr. Money, want to personally apologize for any inconveniences that might have arisen from the virus of our creation. There you go. Now, you see, as you make it to the 52-minute mark... You'll see that they created the virus, as I was saying earlier. Please accept this framed picture of money as cons consolation, where money survives all hardship. Oh man, is this game a political commentary or what? Hold on, I'm cheating. I think I've accidentally broke it. Hold on. Hold on, dear. I'm cheating. Not on you, but in this game. I wonder how many... I know I have a new letter, but I wonder how many levels I can beat just by doing this. I do love me a good indie game, though. Oh, yeah. So if you go above it, it uh, it, it fucks up. People are dying. Their organs are failing because of an antidote for the virus, and everyone is infected. I wonder if I am, too. There seems to be a huge market for working organs now. Dr. Money has a big supply, and everyone is rushing to the stores and spending all their money. But those organs are not what they seem. Also, there is a there is a prequel or an original to this game. This is technically a sequel. But I want you to experience this world and get enveloped in it. And then we're going to see kind of like the, the cross comparison between, I think it's Exposable Money, I think's the name of it. I forget. Hold on. I do like watching that little triangle in the corner. And, you know, it's really funny that a game like this, you know, a Dr. Money's portable. Oh, bollocks. Anyone who uses the doctor's organs die a couple hours later. Where do they come from? What are they? Does it even matter? Are you infected too, friend? Shit. Shit, I guess. I don't fucking know. 
It's like that flapper bird, and now we got geometry dash, but it's like fucked up geometry dash. There we go. Now we got another level beaten. I just kind of suck at it. See, because now instead of the actual obstacles, I got to, like, make sure I land at the right time. Because if I don't, I'll go through the floor. It's a long-ass level. All right. How much of the outside world can you hear in your cell? How high are you even up? I guess I can't know. Just listen closely. And a musical reprieve. As we sit alone in our cell, isolated from the outside world. Is anyone even here with us? How much is being seen? I have no idea and no way of knowing. Beautiful. Not to mention how weird it is that all these messages are arriving in it whilst things are happening. I don't know if you guys can actually see the triangle. I know if you're watching the long version, you can actually see it, but it's just kind of hopping. He, he do be hopping. And it's cool that, uh, but this would be like a Dr. Money kind of game. You know, it's full of bugs, unfinished. It's like every other AAA studio. Is this ga And this game came out forever ago. Is this a political commentary on the whereabouts of games? Did this game predict everything else? Who's to say? There's no way of knowing. There's no way of knowing. How, how would you know? Alright, next letter. Could you hear it from up there? I turned it up extra loud for you. There's no better times than these for little music. And yes, I feel lonely. Of course, I could play the music again, but is it worth it? I'll never be the same magical moment again. That one moment in between all the dreary ones. This can't go on forever. I don't know. This can't go on forever. And the funny thing is, is just because this will show up on people's feed, eventually they'll just pick in at a random moment. You know what I finally noticed? I noticed that if you, uh, that if you're playing, if you're watching like on Instagram Reels, for example, the more you scroll down, you're actually just scrolling back in time. So, like, you'll see, like, repeats of people's old videos. Now, of course, these things are all bugged and uh, nobody really cares. But it's just interesting. You know, the things you understand, like, as you, as someone who's making the videos, you know. It's cool. I don't even know how many people are dead. I'm afraid to look. I can only see what's outside my window. And I can see nothing but blood. I think I'm alone. Everyone is dead. The city's lights are going out. And all you want to do is just see someone come through that door. Someone. Anyone. A guard. A friend. A somebody. The town has no electricity anymore. The only lights I could see are coming from the prison. All the way up here in our isolated little box. I, you know, the metaphor in this game is so interesting. I really do hope that this strategy of this game doesn't just work for the entire game. It would be really funny if it did, though. Look, can anything touch me from the top? I'm outside the screen. 
They're moving faster. <sighs> oh, and there you go. You missed the missed the finish line for all that. One more day. Until what? Is that the game talking to us? How much longer until the next day? The days feel like forever here. Feel like a lifetime. Then I guess being in prison would be like this. I guess with less. Da. Ah. Wait, what? Oh, and you can go through that. You can go through this stuff. That's funny. Tomorrow evening. Until then, you must come here. I will wait here. Well, we have a hope. We have that hope of seeing something happen. What? Hold on, I'm actually playing the game for real now. Let's go. If you can't make it well, I fear this world has no place for me anymore. Hold on, I'm actually just playing the game now. You know, and it goes by better when you actually are doing it properly. When you actually play a game properly, it actually goes by a lot easier. Who'd have thunk it? See, flying above your obstacles. Oh, they're done. Congratulations for completing the game. A valuable badge has been placed in your vicinity. Hey, we got the triangle badge. Cool. I'm awaiting your arrival. Until then, here's a cake I made for you. I hope you like it. Did you hear that wonderful music? I tried to head in this direction, but it was over too quickly. I am so tired. Hey, look, we got a cake. Yay, you can actually eat it. That's cool. I will just go sleep in some empty apartments around here. God knows there are enough of those now. I need to see you again, friend. You are probably still in that cell, all alone. Tomorrow I will come visit you, but first let us rest, friend. Buddy, are you playing your games? Are you happy? I am happy but tired. Sleep, buddy, sleep. Tomorrow it will all end. Day five, an hour and four minutes in. I mean, at this point, you might as well just watch to the end. Might as well. Goody, goody morning. All good, all fine. I don't care. I'm not your friend. I was never your friend. Dr. Money was blackmailing me. He kidnapped my daughters. 
He told me they were safe. He told me they would be okay. As long as I kept you happy. But he lied. My daughters are dead. They died from the virus two days ago. I never even got to say goodbye. But to you, I will. It's hopeless. At this point, you cannot lose hope as I now have. I have another game for you. Sorry, I didn't, I didn't know it wasn't here yet. Oh, here it is. I don't have the money for such expenses. And there's a huge market for organs now. I have already sold one of my lungs yesterday. Now I've finished what I have started. No, it's going to sell his lungs and he can't breathe no more. It's killing me, Simon. It's killing me. I signed for them to take all my organs. Money up front. But where am I game? Where are my subway dog parts? I need it now. I will not survive the procedure, of course, but that's not important. Oh, buddy, no. It's all so bad. I don't like it. You're one of the only ones who are still healthy. Please don't lose hope. I hope you enjoyed the game. But it's not here. Oh, here it is. I doubt it because it isn't fun. Like, seriously, not at all. I wonder what happens if you beat all the games. I hope you keep going anyway. Always keep going. Don't give up like me. You never how much. You never know how much time you have. Okay. Crank master. How do you, how do you play Crankmaster? Oh. What? see you actually have to like hit the keys on the thing god it's obnoxious goodbye I'll play crank master wow it's literally just something to keep you going I mean, it is kind of fun. And it's a good, like, test of dexterity. I didn't think I'd need my compression gloves for this game, but, you know. God, this is obnoxious. You literally just keep cranking. At this point, you're just watching me crank one out. And I mean, it's not like I have to censor it. I'm just, I'm, I'm just doing what the game says. I'm just cranking, just cranking. Just keep cranking. The crank of gameplays. The crank is the gameplay. God, this game sucks. Not Presentable Liberty. This game is amazing. I love it. This is so cool. Like, the, the themes that it's mashing. And, like, and like you, I don't even know. I do want to just beat it, if I can. I mean, I might as well. 
I know there's more letters, but the game does not progress unless I read the letters. Alright, it's literally just me playing WASD. And you have to, like, keep it in, like, a fluid motion. I don't even need to keep it fluid, but I just, like... This is like sitting through an ad read. This is a good fidget thing, though. If only I could do that and read the letters at the same time. It has come to our attention that your happy buddy has stopped talking to you. We would like to remind you that you are loved and you must remain happy. You are worth every penny. Why? Of course I like the cherry. I love cherries. My boy, you messing with my crank sesh. Oh, it's Sal. Oh, what's up? This town is dead. There's no life left in it. I'm walking around these streets all alone. I'm on my way. Sal, please, buddy. I need you here, bro. I need you here. Beep. Does it actually go on the table? Ah, uh, what? That's kind of unsatisfying. Uh, okay. Here. Oh, sorry. <laughs> A little bit premature on that one. Uh, let's play more serpent, I guess. On the same level three. So, Dr. Money is a pharmaceutical company, a black market organ seller, and a AAA game studio all at the same time? Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. I see it, I see it, I see it. Eh, whatever, I don't care. I think I'm close to your prison. I'm really looking forward to seeing you again. You must be in a cell all, all this time. You must still be alive, right? Yes, please. I'm still here, Sal. Please. Please, my god, I need something else other than this door to look at. Is he coming? Please? Yeah, come on. And the dogs are barking. It must be dinner time. Uh. Oh, come on. I'm so close. And you go whap, whap. Am I just now figuring out the game mechanic? You don't actually have to hold it down. Unless you're changing direction. Down, down, down. Okay, whatever. I might be writing to a dead man. That thought is kind of scary. I'll not give up, though. Unless a virus won't kill you now, will it? Nah, I'm good, bro. I'm just in here, losing my mind, talking to a camera, two cameras. Gonna go to various different locations. I've been playing the same games. I ate the rest of the cake. I was hungry. Like, you hungry, you know? Uh... Oh, I'm just going to play more Flappy Bug. He's going to be the, the bugs coming to eat my flesh. Upon whence I die. Yay! I really wonder what happens if you beat all the games. Well, now that I talk about actually beating them... Oh, I had to double tap it. That's so annoying. Ah. 
Listen, we have noticed that you are being contacted by someone with a measurably free spirit. We would like you to ignore all of his letters from now on. No, give me my friend. I need friendship. I need companionship. I desire it. I need it. Hmm. You know? Uh, can you just moonlight? God, this game sucks. It's not even like one of those hard games that are that are fun. It's just a hard game for the sake of it being hard. Like, at least when, like, Dark Souls is hard, you know? At least it's, like, a... Because it's fun. There's, like, lore. And, you know, it looks cool. And, like, you actually get satisfaction. But, like, all I get is these stupid badges. That's like, oh, yeah, you beat the game. Cool. Blah, blah, blah. I'm like, no, I don't care. Ugh. It's just something to waste away the seconds. As that clock ticks down. I don't even know what time it is anymore. You are being taken care of. You are being protected from the virus and the horrors of the outside world. Do not forget, you are a prisoner. Yeah. Ugh, God, I'd rather just... And I can't even, like, get out. I can't even climb on the bed. I can't even look out the window. Is it even a window? only thing I can see is what I can barely see through the grate. You know what? This reminds me... I mean... Yeah. This reminds me of a game called... Uh, not a game. A book called... Uh, Fern like, Escape from Furnace. Uh, there's a... So the second book is all about uh, the guy in solitary confinement. And it very much feels like this. Except in that you're just inside of, like, a very dark just box. Like, if I crank the brightness all the way down... That's kind of what you'd be feeling. But it very much feels like this, except, you know, at least then you could actually have two-way communication because he was, like, banging on a pipe with this made-up code to figure out that... Oh, God. Uh, why did I choose this game? Uh, I hate this. At least Crankmaster had, like, a sense of accomplishment. I think I could see your prison from here. Maybe two, two or more hours now. I can't wait. And once I'm there, I'll release you from your prison, Salvador. Yes, please. My God, this game is depressing. Shut up, Dr. Money. This friend of yours, Salvador, he cannot be here. I do not appreciate the way he talks. I do not appreciate the way he is talking about freedom to you. Is Dr. Money even like a real person? Because, like, the plan of doing this is very much like a human greed thing, but, like, it feels very artificial. Am I being imprisoned by an AI? Maybe. This is no joke. Cease all contact with this Salvador. Nah, bro. He just sent him letters to me, bro. You could just, like, not. Friend, I have arrived. Where is your cell? What are these letters being sent to? I cannot seem to enter the even enter the building. All the doors are locked. He's here? Where is he? Please. Let me out, let me out, let me out, let me out! Let me out! Please. Let me out of here. Sal? I broke in, but the elevator won't come and there's no stairs. It seems I have no way of getting to however high up you are. There must be a way. Please? Please? Sal? Please? Free me from this prison. Friend. Friend. It's getting late, friend. Maybe I don't have to get up there. Maybe. Maybe you could come down here. Please. Anything. Any hope of escaping is... Please. It's just the writing on the wall. You know, this building you're in was never supposed to be a prison. There are no cells on the bottom floor. And looking at the plans, there are no cells here anywhere. Am I in an elevator? Am I the elevator? Maybe. Dr. Money must have 
repurpose the building for locking you up. But why would he do that? It seems so arbitrary. It's too quick? I don't know, dude. Unless... I never really wondered what these two electricals sign up for. But no matter. What matters is that the lock on your cell door is powered by electricity. Which means that... If you cut off the power, you can unlock the door and I can get out of here. If I manage to destroy the prison's generator, you will be free to leave, friend. Sal. Salvador, please. Please. Please let me out. Are you coming? Please. No, Charlotte, I'm coming. I'm coming. I don't think that kind of text. Please, I'm on the way. I'm on the way. I just need to get out of here. Salvador's breaking me out. It's going to be cool. Please tell me that you'll come. Sal, can you please just like be like, yo. What's good? Let me out. I'm so lonely. No, please. Please. Let me out. I'm sorry, friend. No. No. Sal, you gotta get me out of here, bud. You gotta get me out of here. I'm sorry. Oh, God, no. Oh, God, no. No, I couldn't get there in time. No. Remember, money survives all hardship. Like that means anything. Oh, this game. God, this is so depressing. There's nothing I can do about it. Ah! What are we gonna do? I don't know. I have found the generator, friend. I only need to destroy this and you'll be free. Please, just destroy it. Don't send letters to me. Just break it. Let me out of here. Come find me at the entrance, friend. I'm looking forward to shaking your hand once more. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out. It's not even about Charlotte anymore. Uh, the painting looks weird now. Oh. Your friend tried to destroy the generator. It didn't really work out too well for him. He got electrocuted. Your friend is dead. They all are. Now the cell door may be open. But what do you think leaving will accomplish? This town is dead. You and I are the last ones here. The backup generator only has energy for those red lights, so the door is unlocked now. You might just stay in your cell. I will send someone to fix the generator for you. You'll be able to keep playing games on your portable entertainment product without a care in the world. I will even tell you why you're here. You will never know that if you leave. You will be allowed to do whatever you wish to, on one condition, do not open that door. <sighs> In 30 seconds. So online I did see the Hold down escape. Okay, okay, I know. No, hold on. Progress will not be saved. Okay, so you have to do this all in one go. <sighs> do we want to leave? They're all dead. It's dark. You made a wise choice. Now you get to don't enjoy your freedom to play all the games on your entertainment system you want. Congratulations, you imbecile. Do you know why you're locked up here? Of course you would. Of 
course you're aware of your innocence. You know, you know organs are slim now because the virus that created destroys them. Working organs go for a lot of money these days. There's nothing that people value more than their own survival. It doesn't matter how poor the quality of the organs I'm supplying is. They keep coming back to me. But the real money lies in selling high quality organs, which have become from people who are immune to the virus. People like you. Remember the shock you dis you received when you arrived in this prison? That was the only working antidote. You are worth millions now. That is, your organs. I made you relevant. You should be thanking me. You're one of the few people I chose to be immune. You are the one of the few people I locked up. And your organs will be the world's most sought after resource. Thank you for your cooperation. You will be hearing from us shortly. And we press space to go to bed. It's okay if you leave. And you can go watch someone else's playthrough of this. If you leave, you just see that everyone's dead. But I wanted to see this ending because I've never seen it before. And if I'm playing, I might as well just see what happens if we stay here. <coughs> We're dead. Your life lasted 12 more days. In that time, you managed to complete all of the games on your portable entertainment product. Yes, even Crankmaster. I mean, I guess I could have beaten it. You never heard from Charlotte Salvador or Mr. Smiley again. And they were all dead. One sold their organs, the other got electrocuted, one killed itself. You realized that you were alone. You heard footsteps approaching. You saw your cell door open slowly. You couldn't make out the face of the man who entered your cell. Friend? You thought. And died. Wow. The bad ending. Now, the good ending isn't much gooder. Everyone's still dead. It's, there's no winning in this kind of situation. And that goes to show what this kind of thing is. And you just sit there and die. So, even if you leave, it's hopeless. Dr. Money made all the money in the world. Even if, yeah. That was a glorious game. That was amazing. I love that. So, you can start from the beginning. And there's another uh, game on this called uh, Exposable Money. Which is the other game for this. So, if you guys want me to play that game and do another thing like this. It's a very long, drawn out game that's a lot like this. Um, if you want... I will play it, but thank you guys so much for watching. If you made it to the end of this, smash that like button. And if you saw this on all of its preceding cuts, then please share this with people so that they can also enjoy the insanity of this game. And, um, and go look at other people playing it or just play this for yourself. Go it's on itch.io go play or it's on no no it's not it's not on itch.io that's misinformation it's on game jolt go on game jolt go download the game it's super duper it's you saw what it's like see if you can beat all the games including crank master 
God, that game sucks. But thank you guys, and I will see all you dudes in the next video. Bye-bye.